Okay, so I'm going to make the computer say something. Um, the way you make the computer talk, you can't just type in, yo, sup, it'll give you an error. So what you got to do is say, I want you to print something for me. Print something to the screen. So you type print, and then you type a bracket, those little doggy rabbit ear things, and then whatever you want to say. So I'm going to say, yo, raw. And I do that lovely symmetrical thing where I close off each uh, dog ear is paired with another dog ear and each bracket is paired with another bracket. That's important because if you don't do that, you'll be upset. Okay, and that's it. And then hit return and it says, yo rah. Okay, the next thing, um, why don't we, uh, we'll say, hey computer, right? So I'm going to make this thingy. This is like a, a variable. And this thingy is going to be a string called lol. String is just a, a series of little letters or something. So I put the lol in little ears there. So I'm going to say, OK, now it's, a, it's acknowledge that. It's an important step because it hasn't spat out um, red error text at me. So it seems to be accepting with reluctance what I've told it. Now I'm gonna say, let's see if, if if that if it actually believed me. So I'm gonna say, what would happen if I got thingy and added it to another thingy? Actually, like what thingy in general? Firstly, let's let me just see. Yeah, okay. Thingy is lol. So it understands. I taught it a word. It has a vocabulary of one word. And um, now I'm gonna say thingy. What happens if I get thingy plus another thingy? Lol, lol. Excellent. So the nice thing about computers is, like maths, where you can just multiply numbers, the computer, you can multiply words. So I could really get now thingy, if I wanted to make a lol wall, thingy times 200, or like a 2000. This might break the computer. Uh, if you don't break a little bit, you're not trying hard enough. Yeah. Massive lol wall. Okay. It didn't break. Cool. That's enough.